Welcome to the future. You and your unit are now in 2051. We're everywhere. We are food, and they are hungry. Our enemy is smarter, faster, and stronger than you can possibly imagine. Do you want to see something really dangerous? I feel like literally that's all I've been doing since I got here, but okay. I didn't realize how much I missed and like needed a movie like this. It's just awesome. Thank, Thank you, you so much for saying that. Thank you so much for saying that. Yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a great big, fun and exciting movie, but it also has a ton of heart and focuses a lot on relationships between a father and a daughter and uh, a husband and a wife and a father and a son. And I think that that's been really surprising to people. You go in expecting, okay, time travel, aliens, blockbuster movie. Uh, I, you think you know what to expect and you get what you want, but it's not what you expect. We see this cast, right? They time travel 30 years into the future. So let's just say in real life, we were able to go 30 years into the future. You are watching this movie back with your friends and your family. What are the stories that you're going to tell them just to, you know, about the cast, about the film, about the experience, all of the things. I mean, this was really a special experience. I have to say, like, it, it was just a lovely collaboration with lovely people. Like, I mean, I predominantly obviously worked with Chris Pratt and Chris McKay, the director. And I just loved that, you know, we're doing this big action blockbuster alien movie with tons of suspense, but we really got the time, you know, to dive deep into the into the character storyline. So I, I just, I love that. I'll say, Lila, yeah. you were conceived on this movie. <laughs> Mm. And then I'll go to all the very specific details of the night. That she's <laughs> and they'll be like, Grandfather, you need to take your medicine. And I'll say, no, I don't. <laughs> you sit down. I'm in the tomorrow war. Together, we can stop this war from ever happening. And how did it feel like, you know, getting to be the hero, getting to play that part? It's so fun. Like, it's really fun to play, you know, someone who's really strong and um, and smart and can handle herself physically. And also, you know, the fact that she's a scientist and that kind of knowledge wins in the end. You know, I was watching the trailer and Chris, normally I wouldn't ask something like this, but the one line <laughs> that kind of stood out to me, I will be back. <laughs> right? So, I, you know, yeah. considering who your father-in-law is, I, I am just curious if you and Mr. Schwarzenegger, like, did you, has he seen that? He has. Yeah, I showed him the trailer. I showed it in front of the whole family and I said, I do have a line. I say, I will be back. And I just want you to know that it, it just pales in comparison to any time <laughs> you've ever delivered that iconic line. He can bring it up in just a random conversation. Yeah, it's it's going like, to sound cool. Yeah. But then you say it in this. He does it all the time too. He'll get like he'll say lines from his movies and stuff. He'll walk out and be like, "I'll be back." I was like, "How do you think Serena would fare with these aliens?" <laughs> I think Serena would get eaten alive. I mean, <laughs> what she got against a white spike alien. You can stream the Tomorrow War tomorrow on Amazon Prime.